Hey everybody, I'm Spectral Star, and welcome to a new Let's Play called Zombotron. And oh my god, <laughs> it looks really cool. Like, the art style blows my mind. The atmosphere, the music, it is so, so atmospheric. So atmospheric. I can't wait to, like, dive into this again. I did a little practice run to make sure, you know, that I didn't suck at the game, but... Otherwise, you know, it was just the first, like, 30 minutes of the game or so, you know. So we're going to get through that pretty smoothly, I hope. I hope. Uh, but you play as Blaze Rush, uh, a, a space marine who lands on a an unknown planet. And from there on, it's anybody's guess. So let's just say I think uh, zombies might be involved. Just, just saying. Saying that there might be some, yeah. Okay, well, let's go ahead and get started. I'll go ahead and delete this practice session. <clears throat> yeah, it's really atmospheric. Like, listen to that music. I'm so ready for this. Keep clear. <clears throat> Sorry, allergies. He's a very big guy. Ash, batten down the hatches and switch on the ship's security protocols. Yeah, do that. The hatches are locked. The passive security system is activated. Ash, how far is the source of the distress signal? The signal source is five kilometers from our current position. Well, I hope it's an easy walk. Ash, keep me informed of the events and any movement you detect. Accepted. Take care, Captain. All right, so WASD is controls. You actually jump with W, which is kind of weird for me, but whatever. And also, if you jump a little too high and land a little too hard, you land real hard. You know, you get, you just you can't move after you jump super high. At least it doesn't hurt. You aim and shoot. So let's try to. The cursor goes as far as you want it to for aim, which is good. It's good. Skeleton. You can shoot ropes. Okay, so that's basically letting you know that you can use environmental stuff in the game to do things, which you will see soon, <laughs> which is really cool. It's actually really cool because it, it adds flavor to the gameplay besides just shooting things ridiculously. Oh, oh yeah, you got to watch out for these spiky things right here. They're dangerous. Listen to that music. It's sick. Awesome. Oh, -ho. nope. No, sir. I don't think there's anything over here. <clears throat> but from what I've noticed, you can bash through certain walls in the game. Uh-oh. Uh. Was that supposed to be right there exactly? Hmm. I'm not for sure. But I think we need to push it. <clears throat> if we can against that wall shoot it and then back the hell up by the way when you're walking like going oh, these rocks yeah he smashes rocks like it's nobody's business all right if if you move backwards while you're aiming to the right you'll slow down same way with the left which is realistic if you're gonna aim very realistic Captain, can you hear me? <laughs> yes, I can. What's up, Ash? I have detected motion within a few hundred meters of your current position. It appears to be a creature of sorts. Ooh. What kind of creature? Unsure, Captain. There is no database entry for a creature matching this description. Bipedal. Roughly humanoid. Five to six feet tall. Body temperature is about 20 degrees. Ash, can you tell if they're aggressive? cannot be determined. There is no database entry for this creature matching this description. Stop talking like a dumb computer. No database entry. Okay, how far out are they? I want to remind you, Captain, that I am a computer and I detect the creatures are approaching. I advise you watch out. Look, no offense, Ash. I'm out here in the middle of the wilderness. Some creatures are out here too, and I'm feeling a little tense. I'll try to figure out what these things are over and out. <laughs> okay. 
So the, the I guess I'm just gonna give them voices. I, I, I you know, I, I feel like that's appropriate for right now. You know, might as well add a little flavor to the text. Oh Jesus! <laughs> Headshot. Okay, that. Right. So yeah, I could have used this platform here. Maybe I think I could have used it. I'm not sure to kill that one zombie, but that's a lot of this game. Oof. These little blue orbs are level ups, or they're little experience points, and uh, you do get to add points to your uh, your character and stuff. So it offers a lot of variety, a lot of variety to the combat and to the game. <laughs> Love to punch things. I was hoping to use the explosion to kill that guy, but oh well, whatever. The music. It's really good. Huge fan of the music in this game. Oh! <laughs> there you go, there's some environmental death. Eat poop, sir. Eat the poop. This guy is so strong. He's like, suck on that, ass clown. I don't know. I just want to talk like that. And we found a secret. Ooh. And hold on. Yeah. You're dead now. You're dead. <clears throat> it sucks to be you, but you're dead. Oh, yeah. Tab opens inventory. Uh, reinforced marine armor. Okay, now, now one time I got science, uh, scientist armor. So this is different. It's really, uh, it's rare though. Bullets won't pass there. What? Okay, so, you know, it's cool. Uh, it's rare. Uh, guess we're gonna equip that. It's the same set of armor, but usually I get scientist armor, which has a little bit more defense. And we have a pipe wrench. That's new too. Like usually, I just get a like a pipe. I get, you get a pipe. But I guess a pipe wrench. Hmm. I guess you just get different things in different playthroughs. So that's cool. Don't have any grenades yet. Yeah. Okay. New stuff. New things. I'm cool with it. It is getting a. Uh, <laughs> like the, like the previous versions of Project Zomatron. I don't know if you've ever seen them. I just, it just gets sicker every time. Like better and better. The developer does not abandon his games, and it's awesome. It's great to see that. And they all. Well, this game is the only one that I've played of theirs, but I've seen previous versions of Zomatron. Let's go back. Oh. Long time. Oof. Yeah, just wait for that. Come here, bitch. Come on. Try me out. Uh, there you go, baby. That's how you kick ass. <clears throat> I think I might have taken a little damage from that fall. I'm not sure. The hordes come. <clears throat> Sorry about my throat. It's it's really, really congested today. <laughs> I'm trying not to be, but that may be a far gone impossibility. I got a pricker submachine gun. Hmm. I think that's different too. Yeah. yeah it is different. So you do get different loot in each playthrough. That's that's gonna add to the replayability a lot. Get different weapons all the time, different armors. It's really gonna add to the replayability factor. <clears throat> <clears throat> wow. I need to actually read what it says about the 
Ooh, I did it. Okay. So now let's check out what the, the pricker says here. It's like an ant colony wielding tiny stabby swords. Shots with bursts. Shoots with bursts. Shots with burst by six bullets. Damn. That's a lot of bullets though, honestly. Oh well. It does a lot of damage and it's fairly accurate for a submachine gun in my opinion. Boom! <laughs> there goes your face. Jeez. I think I better switch back over to the uh, El Pisto. The El Pisto. Stop wasting bullets, but you know, whatever. Okay, so basically it feels a lot like a 2D Doom. Which I like. It's just a fun little game. Definitely glad. That the uh, <clears throat> the developer sent me an early key on this. Very glad. I didn't know if I should brag about that or not, but uh, yeah, apparently I did already. So whatever. <laughs> it's my first game in that sense. Ooh! <laughs> I'm not doing too bad at this game. Now beat up the bodies. I can't. Well, what the fuck, man? You're just missing. Oh, that one didn't miss. <laughs> Just about didn't miss. One's wearing masks. It's kind of hard to to hit them. I can wear their masks, bro. Did they update this game since the last time I played it, which was yesterday? All kinds of new stuff. Just popping out of the woodwork. Getting closer to, to release. Or just at release. Okay. Whoa. Okay, there we go. It's a it's it's a little stressful this game. Anyways, we activated a, uh... Whoa, Jesus! <laughs> oh, that's funny. That poor bastard. I'm not one to... Say fuck experience, if you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, alright. So, anyways, let's check our experience out. Character, okay. I know I leveled up a little bit ago, but, uh... Now it's time to actually tackle the experience thing. Okay, strength, as far as I know, is for melee. Or maybe it's to base damage, to critical damage. I'm guessing it's to shots, bullets, and whatever, and dexterity. Chance to critical damage, chance to evade. That's a good one. We're going to want some of that. We're going to want some vitality. Just going to try to give ourselves uh, a nice, decent increase to experience, or to, to all of it, you know. Uh, I think I'll go with another strength, though because I like to hit things with bullets and watch them die. That's what I like to do. What's this? Ash, this is going to sound weird, but this isn't a ship. This is a bunker and locked from the inside. Over. Captain, have you tried to knock over? Are you kidding me? The signal is clearly coming from in there. I've got a bad feeling about this. Captain, the signal meets the spaceship encryption standards. I am initiating a scan of the area around the bunker. Okay. Do that, Ash. Bro. Scan it, bro. That mask is cracking me up so hard. <laughs> My scanners are unable to penetrate the hull of the bunker. Well, that's not great. Keep an eye out for an alternate entrance. It looks. Uh, I'll look around here. Hopefully, all this work won't be for nothing. Be careful, Captain. Our comms may not be available inside the bunker. All right, Ash. I'll keep that in mind. I hope this doesn't last long. Over and out. Oh, okay. Shit. 
There we go. <laughs> Uh, suck it, uh, bitch! <laughs> oh, looky here. Found a secret. Okay, this is the first time I think I found this secret. Uh oh, we got the scorpion submachine gun. Man, it really loves giving us submachine guns. Hmm. It shoots with bursts by three bullets. Now that's a little bit more my speed. This mask, Lost Voices mask. The air filter gives you cotton mouth. Ugh, 10% to block damage chance, 10% to armor, plus one to dexterity. That's friggin' awesome. It's an epic mask. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, by the way, uh, you press Q to heal. I think you eat like space rations or something. I don't really know. A little bit crazy here. I'm over here, asshole. Damn it, punch him! Okay, I was reloading, that's why I wouldn't punch things. But whatever, we're still healing. So we're fine. It's an epic mask. Okay. Ow, that hurt. Come on, bridge. Bridge. I don't know why I said bridge, I guess. Dude. Ah. Uh. Okay, what's in here? Anything? We got effortless grenades. Damn it. You bitch. How dare you! I'm just getting you down. Getting you down. <laughs> well, is there anything in here? Mm -hmm. oh. Nothing. Push this wall? No? Ooh. A little bit inaccurate, but you know, I mean, it is. It's got a lot of recoil, I'd say. Is that a fucking double barrel shotgun? Dude! Bro! Can I sell anything? Okay, so now, selling stuff. Now, how much money do we have? 227. I don't think we've got enough to actually. We could sell this thing. I mean. Uh. You know what? Yeah, we're selling it. Sell it. Sell it. I think this will give us enough. I hope so. And boom, there we go. We got enough for the for the double barrel. Oh. Oh, oh. Equip, please. We got bullets too. Oh, so yeah, we don't have enough for more, but we did get like a lot. So let's go. Yo, she bitch, let's go. I hope this thing is totally worth. Cause I love shotguns in any game. Oof. Closer you are, the more dead these things become. <laughs> That's awesome. I love it. What's this? Oh, it's an exit. An exit out of the level. I'm not ready for that yet. I want to make sure. Oh. Oh. Oh, God, I love the shotgun. 
Oh, do I love it. I mean, we'll take the marine helmet, but I doubt it's going to be as good. Yeah, six versus nine. God, we got lucky with that. You probably won't find that on your first run. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But this takes us back out. This is... Yeah, go, go. Let me out of here. Yeah. Look at the lighting in this level. What is that? Oh my god. Environmental effects. I love it. Alright, now we're going outside. Really wish I hadn't used that much shotgun ammo, but you know, whatever. Well, that's interesting. This crash is decades old. But who then reactivated the backup power system? There's no way it was those things. There must be someone else here. Indeed. What the hell? What the hell was that? Memory cube number 45. Price 29. Lara, yesterday something weird caught my attention. In the power room, I heard a muffled whistle somewhere out of the right bla uh, block. <laughs> Might want to check it periodically in case there was a malfunction. Ditmar. Okay. I guess we'll do that. Boom! Okay, cool. So we got that. I really don't know if I want to waste the shotgun anymore, but what, we'll, we'll keep going with it until we have to use the pistol, you know? We'll just have fun. We'll just have fun. Destroyer's mask, sadly. Checkpoint activated. Whoa. Alright, cool. Good. Get my way. There's experience points down there. I need those. Alright, cool. Ugh, oh my Jesus! Don't burn alive, sir. I don't know how to get rid of the fire effect. I really don't. Okay. God, that was brutal. I'm taking a lot of damage now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ugh. Oh yeah. You're dead. Oh yeah. <laughs> Turned into the Kool-Aid man, apparently. Now let's go back up. Okay, we got two in the two in the barrels. Two in the two in the back. Ready to blow something up. Just hit it again. Going upwards. This game's awesome. I love it. I'm in. I'm enjoying the hell out of it. You know what would be cool though, is if they added like an alternate fire mode or something. Time to equip that pistola. I'm not taking any chances. New level. All right. So we get another level. Over here's a secret, which is awesome. Let's check our levels. We get four points, I think, each time we level, which is awesome. Uh, all right, so boom, 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 and boom. I think that's good. I think that's a good. That's a good mix. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. This is practically a blind run. Oh, look at this. Another secret! God, I love the secrets. Oh, shit. Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah. Oh my god, boots. Reinforced army boots, okay. What kind of boots are we wearing? Army boots, okay. These are reinforced, so... Uh, what do they do? Strongly advised to wear with insoles. <laughs> okay, plus one to armor, plus one to vitality. That's good. Equip those. And uh, we should 
probably sell these. Bam. Get a little bit of extra cash. This is a mine. Okay, don't trip. Yeah, so we can throw mines. Canned foods. That's what we're eating. Marine helmet. It's it's okay. I don't I don't think we're ever going to need the marine helmet. But let's put it on. Let's just equip it. Okay, that's what he looks like with the marine helmet on. I like this much better. <laughs> I just really do. Right, let's sell this as well. Is that a first aid kit? Generates health quickly. Always good to have one of these on hand. Yeah. I'd say so. So we've looked at all the inventory stuff. I'm guessing we're going to have to... Uh... Oh! <laughs> Let's drink some liquids. What does this do? Ooh. La la. Cool. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and open this up. I believe when I'm healing, the game kind of stutters, but I am at like 2K resolution, so that might be... It's okay though. It's it's doable. It's I can live with it. Game's so much fun anyway. See when the healing stuff stops, it's all smooth bananas. I guess it's something they'll probably patch day one. You know, that's what I'm thinking. It's not that hard to fix, I'd say. Now let's head back up. I mean up, up. Yes. Woo! <laughs> Okay, since we went this way, let's go the other way. Oh, God, they killed each other. Smart, smart robots. Or smart zombies, whatever they are. Smart plant monsters. Okay, this gun. I want something fierce, but I don't have enough to buy it. I don't have enough. Okay, so... What else do we do? I mean, we can't just go back this way, right? I'm glad that didn't hurt. We gotta go down. Yeah, that's it. <sighs> but, we're gonna do that next time on Let's Play Zombatron. I hope you guys have enjoyed this first episode. More to come. I'm Spectral Star. Oh my, Kodoku.